The Carrollton Dawnbreakers hosted a 9-11 memorial service Wednesday morning at the Carroll County Veterans Memorial Park, a ceremony in which they remembered the 13 U.S. service members killed August 27th during a U.S. evacuation operation in Afghanistan. I've said this many times before, I think this is one of the best veterans parks in West Georgia, if not even further. And I've traveled a lot of times around the world with the Army, and I have to admit this is really it. What we're going to do today is have a very short, dignified ceremony. We're going to read the names of the fallen from Hamid Kasai International Airport in Kabul, Afghanistan. I will read the names. Don will ring the bell. So with that, on August 26, near the gates of Hamid Karzad International Airport, Kabul, Afghanistan, 11 Marines, one Navy sailor, and one Army soldier were killed. The fallen include Marine Corps Staff Sergeant Darren T. Hover, Salt Lake City, Utah. Marine Corps Sergeant Johnny Rosario Pisario, 25, of Lawrenceville, Massachusetts. Marine Corps Sergeant Nicole L.G., 23, Sacramento, California. Marine Corps Corporal Hunter Lopez, 22, Indio, California. Marine Corps Corporal Dagan W. Page, 23, Omaha, Nebraska. Marine Corps Corporal Humberto A. Sanchez, 22, Loganport, Indiana. Marine Corps Lance Corporal David L. Espinoza, Rio Bravo, Texas. Marine Lance Corporal Jared M. Smith, St. Charles, Missouri. Marine Lance Corporal Riley J. McCollum, Jacksonville, Wyoming. Marine Lance Corporal Dylan R. Mercera, Ranchero Cucamonga, California. Marine Lance Corporal Karen M. Nicoy, Norco, California. Navy Hospital Corps Hospital Corpsman Marksum W. Sovak, Berlin Heights, Ohio. Army Staff Sergeant Ryan C. Naus, Prairie Town, Tennessee. We are so grateful to have a veterans park like this in our community. And I know that there's a lot of our members who haven't had the opportunity to come out here and to experience this park and to see all of the symbolism that it holds. So we're very thankful that Mr. Barry and Mr. Don are gonna take an opportunity to show us around the park today. So we're gonna kind of split up into groups to do that. But we also, as a Rotary Club, recognize the importance of this park. So on behalf of the Carrollton Dawnbreakers Rotary Club, we wanted to make a small contribution to you guys just for this park and the betterment of this park so that our community can continue to enjoy it for years to come. The purpose was, you know, we've got a lot of people in our Rotary Club who had never been out to see the park, but really just we wanted to take this week to commemorate 9-11, but to also remember all of the servicemen and women who have not only given their lives, but have given their time to protect our freedoms and the freedoms of others around the globe. And so it was very important for us to, while remembering 9-11, to also remember those 13 men and women who were killed in Afghanistan. And, you know, it's just, as a country, we needed to take some time to pause and reflect on all of that um, and remember you know, what unites us instead of what divides us.